Throw the bag. Ahead of a scorching hot weekend, Montgomery County Fire trains certain members on Potomac River rescues. Oh, my left foot, my left foot's left stuck. Foot. One drill involves saving someone whose foot had become stuck under a rock. Another required grabbing hold of a victim traveling downstream. It's a lot harder than one may think. The idea is we get in the swift water and we practice in that. We learn to swim in it. We practice throwing ropes, all the things that we might have to be called on to do. Montgomery County Fire responds to all Potomac River rescue calls between the D.C. and Frederick County lines. On average, the swift water team handles 100 calls per year, many of those along the Billy Goat Trail. It's hard to put a firm number on the cost of each response, but the bare minimum includes three swift water inflatable boats, an EMS unit, a support unit such as a fire engine, and a helicopter typically provided by the U.S. Park Police. Over the last decade, Montgomery County has averaged around seven Potomac River drownings a year. Last year was below average with two drownings. So far this year, there's been one. We prepare for the worst, but we absolutely don't want to come out. We'd rather have a year where nobody dies in the river at all. 